Hey guys, Blazer here, and in today's video, I will be showing you how I make abominations like this. And if you want an ugly one, like this. Uh, but these are my homemade Pokemon. Well, not homemade Pokemon, like homemade Megas and go like uh, regional forms. Uh, and some are megas of regional forms. Uh, yeah, in the last video I showed you my Mega Weavile. And I just want to show you this ghost dragon type Flygon I made. But I'm going to show you how I do that in today's video. So this guy has been asking for this a lot. And I'm like, I, like I've been trying a lot to do like make this but I keep like making the video like super like bad and then I forget what I'm gonna say and then I like just stay silent uh and then it really is like uh what do I do but yeah we're back at it again we're gonna do this or I'm just gonna show you how I do this and like make an abomination. So first, I'm gonna show you how I use the magic wand tool. To so I just I have it on consecutive feeling, just so you know. And uh, I, if I want to change the color, select all this. Oh yeah, if you didn't notice, make sure you. If you want to like make a mega, you could draw it, but if you're doing it like me, you can just import an image and then just edit it. Edit it, edit it. Did I get that spot? Nope. Apparently no. Okay, and then I use the digital pen and I put it at opacity 20 and I make my brush all the way big then I choose my color let's say a like a, a green and then I go over it I'm like mm, that doesn't look good go over it again and go over it again and then we got our green talon flame and then there's like lit only do this with little spots i'll show you why so if there's like spots like this just use the blur but don't use them by a uh, black like if there's blur right here then yeah don't i wouldn't use it right there uh if there's like blur right there uh like i do this uh here's an example i just hold down right there get that color I use this with like a lower opacity and go over it. And then it's better. Or you could just completely uh go rogue and just digital full opacity. Uh and then, if you want it to like blend in more, you could blur it. And then, like right there, I need it to like right here. But try not to get like black smudges. Uh. So here we got our green bird. The next tool I want to show you guys is. The lasso. I use the lasso a lot. Okay, so what we're going to do next. We're going to use the lasso to give this guy more legs. Like, you want him to look like a freak. So we're going to take a leg. Wait, no. We're going to make it. And don't worry if that happens. You could just do that. Uh, take a leg. We're going to duplicate. And I'm going to have it under. Uh, I'm 
then we're going to add chicken leg behind him. Then we're going to duplicate. We're going to move another chicken leg behind him. So you see what I'm doing? I'm just adding chicken legs behind him. Uh, but then, yeah, whoa. Then you could go to this leg. Whoa, nope. And then let's duplicate. Put it under. And then let's move this. And let's put it right there. I'm proud of myself for making uh, such an ugly abomination. Uh, and I use the transform tool, which I'm just using here, as you can see. Okay, so this is our six-legged chicken. That's green. Uh, whoa. And yeah, that's how I use this app. But if you want to do something else, like, let me see. The eyedropper, like, I recommend you just hold your finger down and then you could use it. But what you could also do is... This is what I do sometimes, and it helps a lot. Like, if I take something, and I only want it on one layer, but since I took it from one layer, it's not on the other. Like, I duplicate that, but I don't want it on this layer. I could just, I usually use the eraser to delete it. And then with this one, I like, like, I don't know, do something like, Make it a bendy wing. A bendy straw wing. That's what I'm going to do next, guys. Bendy straw Pokemon. I'm kidding. Imagine a bendy straw Pokemon. But yeah, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. And like and subscribe. Comment down below if you enjoyed this video and if you want to watch me uh, do the process of making like a mega, then make sure you comment down below if you want to see that and then I will do it uh, in front of you guys on camera and then you'll see the process. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Hope you liked it and goodbye.